All right, let's begin the next quest where children toil, toys await. <clears throat> now, I don't know if this quest is going to be all like cutscenes or not, but I'm going to stick to my statement where I said that I'm splitting up every single video with this own quest. If it takes three parts for one quest, then it takes three parts. So I'm not going to upload, you know, a two hour, you know, quest line on YouTube. I'm trying to split it up. So if this quest ends up being like seven minutes, then it's seven minutes. You, you little fuck. Let's begin. I'm going to be a little quiet during the cutscenes, as always. So how would you explain it? Whether it pours for a week or the sun bakes our pates, we've always mud up to our ankles here. You can't blame me for Beauclair's fickle weather. Fickle weather? I've seen you. You empty your chamber pot in front of our shop each morning, so folks will dirty their boots go to you to get them cleaned. A far-fetched conspiracy theory, sirs. I'll conspire to welt your bum with my belt. Come here. Leave him alone. Just who the spit are you? Um, his father? <laughs> His father, and you won't touch him. I won't let you. Oh, poppycock. I knew his father. A grifter, a cheat, just like his brood. I'll teach him honesty. He well, I mean, they didn't fall for it. Shop door just to draw patrons to his own stall. So back away, drifter. I tried. Not gonna happen. Won't it? Well, then we'll thrash you as well. Which is all the same to me. All right, okay, we're into it. All right, just fighting. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is... Okay. I don't think I'm gonna win this. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna win this. Oh wait, I can take, I can take Superior Swallow? Seriously? Wow, I didn't even know that. Oh fuck, dude, this is too hard. There's one. There's one. These guys are tough, man. I have more fun boxing than like actually playing the game sometimes, you know? I find this shit so fun. It's not allowed that there we go. That's the most action I'm gonna get today. There we go. Uh. I fucking love the boxing mini games in this. Woo! I guess it's so fun to me. I can't be the only one who just enjoys those boxing matches in this game. <laughs> All right, well. What's the meaning of this? The brawl? Who started it? I'm investigating. Let me hit him back, though. The Duchess's orders. Ah, yes. We've heard of you. And these men. What are they doing? What are they doing? Uh, nothing kind of misunderstanding or making. Di well, we're gonna go with difficult because I want to be an asshole. Fuck these guys. Obstructing my investigation. Damn. Understood. Right. A few days in the clink ought to teach them not to impede official dutchy business. We just ratted on them. Come on. They kind of deserved it, though. So it's okay. It's not exactly ratting. You're very good with your fists, sir. Wouldn't be looking for work, would you? We'd make a fine duo. The fuck? Yeah? How you imagine that working? Splendidly. That's how. I suggest a partnership. Where I see to the boots while you stand This kid's guard. like 10. As you're the stronger. Come He's a morning, fucking businessman. You pot out and help me make mud. Bit about the mud's true. They were right to want to box your ears. I've got to make a living somehow. So, what say you, sir? Partners? Let me think about it. Uh... Sure. Listen, I'm interested in a certain gentleman. Oh, wait, wait. Before we get to talking, please, take a seat. 
How awesome would that be if this turned into a side quest? But my boots are clean. In this city, no boots are clean unless they've just come off my stunt. A seat, sir, please. This kid's smooth with the words, man. True businessman. I would love to do a side quest with me just guarding the stand while he just shines shoes. So then, please make that a side who mission. Was it you wanted to ask about? One of your patrons. Tall, elegant black frock. Not from around here. An arrival? Hmm. Indeed, I hear a faint bell ringing. A modest sum might make it sing out loud and clear. How much? Let's say... 500 crowns. What? Gotta be kidding me. What would you even do with that kind of coin? Expand my venture. I'm sure you can imagine. Have a... 500? With a big sign? I want a new box, too. New polishes, new brushes. And... If I've enough coin left, I'll buy a share in a launderer's. Get waste water for free. Hmm. Got it all planned out. I should think so. Capital is all There's I no way this kid's that smart. There's absolutely no way. Should I should I axe him? Should I axe this kid? That'd be so fucked up. Alright, we'll negotiate, little man. Alright. You're Let's sweet. We can't figure something You're smooth out. with the words. I respect it. I'll give him five hundred. I'm not gonna bargain down. Alright, I'll pay the five hundred, man. All you. Guess I can agree to that. A thousand thanks. I shan't forget it. Now to the matter at hand. I know the fellow you seek, though I don't know his name. A steady patron. Gets his boots cleaned every few days. He's very good to me. Always pays me a premium. Know where I might find him? No. But you could wait here. Perhaps he'll stop by. Don't have the time for that. Sure you don't know where to find him? Or maybe notice which direction he came from? When I clean boots, sir, I do not look up to see where folk come from. I clean. It seems you're having a rough go of it. Oh, you're here. Feeling better? Ah, oh, shit. What I the fuck are you doing here, Regis? The local necropolis. The what are you doing here, Regis? Now, if I might intercede, I dare say I've the right question to ask. Young man, you see this vial? One drop added to your boot polish will help you wipe even the most encrusted boot clean as the dome of St. Lebioda's Cathedral. With it, you will serve three times as many patrons at a fraction of the effort and piles more coin. I'm prepared to give you this vial if you tell me where the man we seek lives. Uh, but you won't hurt him, will you? The gentleman's art, true, but he's kind. In point of fact, he's a friend. Yet we had a falling out of sorts and would like to straighten matters out. I leave his boots at the door of a house near the port. The door is red. But I do not know if the gentleman lives there. Worth checking. Might happen on a lead. Would you let me scrape the dirt off your kickers before you go? With all due respect, sirs, your boots could stand a cleaning. Thank you. Perhaps later. Perhaps later. So wait, that cleansing solution gives him... Damn, dude. So this kid made out big today, man. I paid him five hundred dollars. Handled that kid pretty I paid him five hundred dollars, well. and then he gives a cleansing bitch. solution. That's the trick to dealing with children. Mm, yeah, saw that. Meaning the right thing to bribe them with. That kid came out good today. Five hundred dollars and a cleaning solution that makes his job a lot easier, and makes him more money. Red door. One the boot black mentioned. So we just go in? I, I guess so. I don't think we're just gonna walk in this dude's house. Fuck it, right? Knock, knock. Won't budge. Gotta break it down. You might just as well stand out in the street, pound on a drum, and holler, Deck laugh, I'm coming for you. A bit more finesse, I implore you. Let's hear your idea. Give me a moment. Nice. Ever consider becoming a burglar? A skill like that had come in awful handy. I considered it briefly, but ultimately concluded it would be terribly dull. Come.
This is not creepy at all. In here. Sense him. <sighs> no, he's not here, but he was here recently. His scent is still strong. This is so creepy. This dude's really living here? Let's look around. Why? Please be a jump scare. This is going to be a jump scare here. I bet you. Old toy. No use to anyone. Shame. Must have brought someone joy sometime. Okay, what else can we examine? Attic. Let's go. Anything else up here? So this is his nest. Suspicious Let's look around. Detlaf van der Heretain, you do not know us, but we know you to be a vampire. We know also of your weakness for the wench they call Renawed. Now you know this. We shall chain her down and let rats feed on her. We shall flay the skin from her flesh. Yet you can save her. You need but travel to Beauclair, where you shall slay five men in the manner we prescribe. You must complete the killing in three days. Fail, and the next letter you receive will contain a memento of your failure. Your beloved's finger. There you oh, shit. It. Proof positive Detlov killed not of his own accord. A black male has sunk his claws into him. What? Well, I guess that does make sense why he's killing everyone. I was wondering why he was, but I guess that explains it now. Any idea what it could be? Detlaf have any enemies? Indeed. Detlaf gains foes occasionally, but they never live long. One might have managed to evade him. Possible in theory, but I know of none. It would have to be someone devilishly dangerous. As you well know, having faced Detlaf yourself, whoever it is, it is someone new. Who the fuck is Renawed? Who's Renawed? His one-time lover. The sole human woman with whom he was very close. Because she accepted him. With her aid and oh, care, that's his dime piece, he found isn't it? A place for himself in this hostile world. She began the work that I strive to continue. Never meet her. Never had the pleasure, alas. She deserted him a time before he came round to save me, though he always claimed she'd gone missing. Uh oh. Why did he believe she'd gone missing? Why do you think that? Any signs or clues to that effect? None to be found. Apparently she disappeared one day. Her belongings disappeared with her. Not a scenario one associates with kidnapping. In my humble opinion, she left on her own. Scared off, perhaps, by a bout of Detlaf's rage that revealed his other, more monstrous side. Detlaf have trouble letting go, accepting that she'd left him? Is that so hard to believe? Do you know no humans who've struggled with just such a thing? And Detlaf is so much more emotional than most humans. Not only was she his beloved, his lover, his mate, she was a member of his pack. And one never leaves one's pack voluntarily. Fuck. Um. Detloff ever try to find her? I mean, if she was that important, higher vampires have their ways, all kinds. Should have been easy as pie for him. Geralt, as you rightly noted, we are vampires, not miracle workers. He searched. For months on end before giving up. Clearly, Renoued knew him all too well. Enough to cover her tracks, leave no way for him to find her. Even if Renoued did abandon him that time, looks like someone's actually kidnapped her this time. Hard to argue with that. And hard to foresee what he's prepared to do to free her, get her back. Yeah, I kind of feel bad for Deadlife now. He's prepared to kill, that's clear. As would you be for Yennefer. He kills, for he cares for her deeply. And that blood, those individuals, they mean nothing Man. to you. That's true. Would I kill for Yennefer? I've done. Yeah, I get it now. He's out to rescue a female from his pack. I've had kill for Yennefer plenty of times. Exactly. Right, so someone's blackmailing him. We know that. Still have no idea who. Need to look around some That's more. That's bullshit there. Cause I did kill for Yennefer, but it was necessary. I guess this is a scenario it is kind of necessary because she's got kidnapped. And if he doesn't do what they say, 
go flare like a fish, but I don't know. I don't know. What else could we look for here? Tools? Tools were used recently. Deadlock unwind by fixing toys between murders. Really, no, Geralt. <laughs> that was good. That was a good joke you threw in there, <laughs> Does Detlef have a hobby <laughs> of fixing toys in between murders? <laughs> He's such an asshole. Nice tune. Indeed. I'm not certain why, but it reminds me of home. Our true home from before the conjunction of spheres. I don't know what I'm supposed to be looking for. Woman's likeness. Bit smudged. That Renawed. I don't know. As I said, I never met her. Reminds me of someone. Who? Not sure. Can't help feeling I've seen that face before, though. Am I supposed to know that? Because I have no clue who the fuck that is. Okay, here we go. We found something. Look. Slips of paper. Name on each. Count Crespi. Count Duak. Milton de Peyrac Peyron. Count de Lacroix. Detlef's victims, one and all. But that's not his hand. Must have come from whoever wrote the letter. All of it written using the same ink. There's only four, though. See the color? Where's the fifth? Ink was dyed with cinnabarite. Rare mineral. Pretty much found only in... Nazaire. But I fear it means very little. Anyone could have imported such ink. Fair enough. Still worth remembering. Look, this slip is stained. With wine. Not much to go on either. Especially not in Beauclair. Perhaps. Yet perhaps also worth remembering. Fair point. I don't understand. There's only four slips. He said there was five targets. The fifth target's going to be like someone. I, I have a feeling. I know. Blackmailer. Kind of curious who it could be. Why is that? Regis. Somebody kidnapped a vampire's lover. Bold to begin with. Now they're forcing the vampire to kill. A vampire you yourself insisted no murderer. Blackmailer's skilled. Someone special. Hmm. Astute. Now that I think of it, I'm beginning to wonder if... It's not one of your kind? Another vampire? Precisely. The plot thickens. Just a hypothesis. Wouldn't set my heart on it till we know more. Right you are. Let's sum up what we know. Seems Detlaf's being blackmailed. Someone's been feeding him his victims' names. All noted down using one and the same Nazari ink, and not in his handwriting. Not much. But enough to ascertain Detlaf's innocence, clearly. Hmm. <sighs> yeah, I guess. Actually, it is. Detlaf's being manipulated. Some lunatics turned him into a tool, making him kill. So it would seem. But this illuminates a path of action for us. We must find Renowed. Render the blackmail senseless. The lunatic or ticks will thus lose hold on Detlef. That's one idea. Hmm. Could be worth a shot. But what about Detlef? He gonna go on killing while I'm out searching for his lover? He will not. I shall convince him to stay his hand. Assure him you're a friend seeking to help. I'll await him here. He's sure to return sooner or later. Think he'll listen? He will. Ought to wait with you, maybe. No, he'll sense you from a mile off. Simply fail to appear. I'd better stay alone. You must trust me on this. Fine. Need to report to the Duchess first. So be it. We'll await you here. Debt laugh. I'm just gonna boat. sit in this creepy ass toy store, Regis. Come on, Regis Filman. Are you really gonna just sit in there, man? Oh, is that the end of the quest? Okay. All right. Well, I guess that was the end of the quest. We did think. I figured that there would be a short quest eventually. We got 800 experience for that? Holy shit, this game just dishes out experience. Alright, so that's the end of that quest. Alright. Next video, I guess, will be the next quest, which is Wine and Sacred.